bitch, my stick on the seat. Call the on the feet. Pull up, you tryna compete. Who got the whip of the week? You want a custom whip? Just hit slick, he got you. Watch how he put it together. He like the car doctor. Yeah, yeah. Who got the whip of the week? Who got the whip of the week? Who got the whip of the week? Stitch my slick on the seat. Who got the whip of the week? Who got the whip of the week? Who got the whip of the week? Stitch my slick on the seat. This your boy Slick, and this is my whip of the week. What's up, Tuesdays? And two bits. We riding that flat line today. I'm putting a few miles on this one, man. About to take it to the shop. When we pick up Hillary. And um, I got a few things I need to um, to do to get a flat line all the way back a hundred. This one here, man, I pretty much built the, um, this is a 07, 08, um, Tahoe, Tahoe Suburban engine, 5.3, uh, we did a stage 2 Texas Speed, um, cam in this one with a, um, 2800 stall, and this one here, actually, man, it, it turns up really really good uh, my guy uh, Troy rest in peace Troy man uh, he put this one together for me and um, I've been rolling and I've been rolling and loving it ever since he done this one So like I say, this is pretty much a 5.3, um, 07, 08 Tahoe. <clears throat> With this one, I did a Cadillac SRX, XRX interior swap on this one. Now this one here has been done probably about Five years I did this in 2016, 2017. Did the four Giardos on it, 26s all the way around. Full air ride management system. Did the roll pan. Much smoothed it all off. Took all of those body moldings, body body lines, shaved the bumpers. As you can say I'm about to put it back in the shop, man, and go get it repainted. I'll cut about an inch off of each side of the bumpers so they don't stick out so far. Smoothed all of the bolt holes on the front. Welded all of them, smoothed them. Um, what else we did? The cow. I smoothed it. The cow took all of those little vents out. I'm about to get it all the way back. All the way back right. I did the Camaro brakes. 
Camaro big brakes on there. Calipers and all. I even cut for some vents. <laughs> cut for some vents in there. But this is just my 85 uh, Chevrolet short bed, man. Runs good. I done drove it to Myrtle Beach several times, which is about three hours, three and a half hours from us. So I think I'm going to switch these seats out and put some much nicer, lower style seats in it. It just had its time. Like you say, nothing crazy. Dakota Digital Gauges. It's a nice clean truck. Nice clean truck. I did two eights behind the seat. The two eights. A little light work. That's my air ride. Front, back. Up and down buttons. Headlight switch. Got the headlights on and off. loose oh she breaks loose now don't get it twisted I'm about to get in flat line more often man after I take it back to the paint shop I'm gonna do a um, two inch cow hood I like the way it looks man it looks aggressive uh, I'm definitely thinking about um, Definitely thinking about changing the wheels. Give me a give me a different look. Like I said, I had them on there a few years, so it's I want to switch it up. So if anybody interested in it, let me know. I'll make you a pretty good deal on Baby, she still roll now. She still roll. Flatline been a pinnacle. That's my other buddy. We finna bring these trucks back. These trucks back in the game. Show y'all what's been missing, man. Man, so that's that episode of Ride with Stitch. Let me know what y'all think, man. Hit that subscribe button, man. Show your boy some love. We moving around some cars today. Getting organized, getting a few up out of here. That's about that on that, man. I'll be back in a minute.